with yourself, focus more on your age than you are on your actual aging experience. Earlier this week, I touched on what our aging experience means and how we get to make it look like what we want it to look like. But one of the points I didn't hit is the importance of not focusing so much on your age. A lot of times when we focus on that age, we start kind of beating ourselves up, especially if we thought we'd be further along in our careers or with the relationship or we'd be able to do more than what we're doing. We tend to begrudge our age and in turn become ages towards ourselves. But when we focus on that good old Asian experience and look at the things that we're learning or have learned or the things that we've overcame or things that we're in the middle of but we're able to manage where we are right now, I think that that has a better impact on our aging experience and can contribute to our well-being in some kind of way. It's all about shifting that perspective on things. So let's try not to focus so much on this age and just really concentrate on the aging experience and the things that come our way. So tell me, what are some things you're able to do or things that you've learned all because of your aging experience? Let a girl know, cause I'm sitting up in my room. Wait till 